Okay, that worked out. What do you got? What do you got? Huge toothpick, tier of the shot, speed up. Death card, stars card, the moon card. Set me to it. Whoa, look at this. Look what we found. Super secret room, ultra mega secret room, whatever you want to call a secret room. We get the ultimate sacred heart, homing shots, damage up. GG, ladies and gentlemen, GG. Twenty-three. Let's dive right into it. See where we stand. We are playing as a keeper to the lamb. No, I don't know who that is. We're gonna be fine though. I'm actually a big fan of the keeper. I don't really play with him as often. Let me see. What is this? Cracked orb, shard of knowledge. I think that's the one where if I take damage, good stuff happens. Pheromones. I'm down. I would love car battery. If there's a way to get car battery, that is the way to go. Car battery is going to double our active item. Sequin could probably probably be on the right. Careful, let's get rid of the flies first. I do see tinted rock, but as a keeper, we do not retain any HP. Our HP is the coins. So an opportunity to pop this as many times as possible. Something we should consider if there's an opportunity to go ahead and pick up the car battery, it's something we should do as well. Keeper is an interesting character. Obviously cannot retain HP, but he has that triple shot, which is insane. Sequence probably, probably right here. Okay, it is. Pop you. Hope for the best. Hope for some money. We didn't get money. Careful, pop him. Are we able to get to the 15 cents? That's a big concern for me. Unless we get pageant boy. Might as well take this pill. Tears up is huge right now. We're at 1.14. I mean, we could pop this at the same time. I don't think it's going to give us any benefit. That's nothing over there. We could play this out. Let's 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 really like weigh our options. What's over here? We could blow him up. It hopes that he drops a nickel or a dime. We can't because we can't retain hearts. It's going to be flies. So pop up that tinted rock doesn't seem that useful right now. Keeper versus Gemini. It's a variant version. Shout out to the Gemini's. This shouldn't be that difficult. Again, we have that triple shot. But it's here right at 1.14. We should be okay. Just gotta keep our distance. Now, what do we want from this boss drop? Honestly, I wouldn't mind pageant boy. Just so we can go ahead and get that car battery. I think the car battery combo with our wooden nickel holds a lot of value since our hp comes from coins we would want to optimize that as much as possible but we get growth hormones which isn't bad as well get a nice little speed and damage we're sitting at 6.23 now with this one bomb what do we really want to do i think we should try to play this out does it drop a coin first tap whoa that was huge what's down here two clubs now we got more bombs we also got secret passage what do you got pills okay let's let's think about this money that's what i want what do we got retro vision okay and balls of steel more flies okay so we got three bombs i think we should pop the keeper that should be something we should do is there anything in here there is a pot down there but there is our super secret room so we'll save a bomb for that i see it Okay, nothing there let's hope for some money we got two bombs i mean we could make something happen here let's see what's in here first though just a bunch of flies okay okay with one bomb i think we should blow this up probably gonna give us absolutely nothing a small rock damage up speed down okay we gotta we gotta play this out what if happens if i tap it again absolutely nothing again are we willing to take the risk? Yes. Okay. So nothing happened. There is a super secret room over there. How do I even get? I don't think I can get there. Even if a bomb, I don't think I can get there. All right. So we can't buy anything. I think our best bet is to buy this, the devil and a bomb. Can't even buy a bomb. All right. Was that a waste? Probably. So we're gonna have to hope for some coins. I mean, I could have used the bombs to pop those chests, to be quite honest with you. I mean, the pots probably should have been the the big brain play to do. 
Uh, so we gotta really be careful here. Basement two. Just keep our distance. Let our flies do all the work for us so we can get this. And we're back in the money. Our damage is at 7.74. I mean, that's that's pretty good. That is exactly what we want to be. Sequence probably in between these right here. Down here. Careful. Pop you. Our flies are just extremely strong. No keys. Can't go into our treasure room. Actually, I think we can get into the shop for free. I've got to remember the trinket. So let's see if that is real or not. I think it's called the sh shop key, I think it's called. I'm not super familiar with the trinket. Hold on. Yep, for free. Okay. With six cents, what do we want to do? Um, I think we should go ahead and try to get this for a key. Yeah, that's what we want. That's exactly what we want. All right, so let's go ahead and go straight to our treasure room. Even though we're playing as a keeper, you have to play a little strategic. That's huge. That This is like a boss killer. That's a, that's a The pinky shears is an automatic boss killer. We can pick up a bomb and a key with it if we get nothing out of it. Um, Nothing in here. I don't see. Okay, play this, play this smart. We don't need to blow anything up. Literally just in and out. Pop that. Careful. I kind of want to save my flies for the boss. We have to go angel deal. Um, because devil deal, I think, costs money. Obviously, we don't have enough money to make it work. Ooh, careful. I'm actually not going to take any pills anymore. We know what we need. Uh, we're pretty much good on that part. Keeper for Steven. Another variant version of Gemini. But call Steven. Careful. Push it back, push it back, push it back. Clear some space. Get a little bit more optimal space. That way when he pops, he pops there. Pop that. Um, I'm actually going to go Angel Deal. So I'm going to skip out on the Devil Deal. Uh, where are we on time? Five minutes? I mean, we still have some decent amount of time to explore just a little bit. I was hoping for this. Uh, but we have no bombs. We can pick up the Pinky and Shears to fly over and skip all that. Or... We can use the pink and shears to go into the cursed room for, I think, half off. Let's blow you up. I like little Steven, man. Little Steven's great. He has, like, a little spoon bender effect to him. I forgot I had the double card as well. Should use that on the next floor for the next boss. And I'm saying, if we were able to get the car battery with the wooden nickel, we would been having a lot more opportunity to get some more money out of it. But, obviously, we don't have that. We should definitely use the pink and shears for this room. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do. I feel like that's the play. Seek room cannot be there. Seek room probably down there. But first things first, let's grab the pinky shears. We're gonna use it so we can fly. That that's the best way I think we should use it. We'll be able to get some money out of it. We we'll also get this chest here. So pop this. Now we can fly. Open that up. Some more money. Grab this. Grab that. Look at this. So now you know honestly this would probably be the best way to get the devil deal but you know it is what it is we had an opportune moment obviously it didn't work out we could go into the curse room again and there's nothing in the shop that really entertains it i think seek room's down there i'm gonna try i have two bombs obviously you want to leave with the wooden nickel it's a very hard item to get rid of considering who the character is like we're playing as a keeper wow it's not there so you really want to stick with survivability as fine as this. Consider the wooden nickel as like a book of revelations, a satanic bible. Anything in the long lines of that is actually really important to have and keep. Let's blow that up. We want as much money as possible. A chest and a chest. We like that. Look at that. We got our bomb back. 24 cents. Two keys. One bomb. That's what we want. Um, I don't know where the secret room is. I'm probably not going to look for it. Super secret is probably down here. But with one bomb, I don't want to waste it. Interesting enough, I just looked at our angel deal. It dropped to negative 33.8%. That is odd. That is very odd. Um, we should absolutely do this, but let's pop our devil card. That's why we do that. That's sick. Okay, so tier rate's at 1.32. That's huge, man. That's huge, especially with the triple shot. I mean, if we can get to 1.6, that's great. Look at that. Big bucks. 30 cents. Pop everybody. With a 10.11 damage, that's pretty good. But again, that's... that's yeah, I was about to say 7.74 is where we really stand. Careful. Don't they got that super jump with them. And one thing to remember when you're playing as Poppin' first, when you're playing as characters like these, like the Keeper, Tainted Lost, or Lost, um, sometimes even Tainted Eden, positioning really, really I'm about to get hit here. Yep. I was about to say, I was about to get hit. Luckily they dropped money. 
But anyway, well, like I was saying, when you play as characters like this, you really, really have to be careful with your positioning. As it truly matters where you land. And with one tap can end the game. I mean, so, especially like the keeper where you do not get HP. Everything is money. Your HP is the money that you got. So you really gotta really know when you want to pop the wooden nickel and you want to pop it in the room that you're in do you want to save it careful pop you i feel like secret was probably above here i only got one bomb i don't want to test it i want to save it for something that makes sense obviously we're going here mom's coin purse Eee, seven cents though i mean it kind of removes it from the pool itself one of these are tears up there it is and i don't really care for the rest to be quite honest with you um i'm actually gonna buy this strength card is great strength card is great so it's tears up at 1.69 man that's that's solid that's where you want to be at careful they dropped a little bomb yep that could have been dangerous that could have been really dangerous but our is looking good, man. Hopefully, we get an angel deal out of this and see where we stand. Pop that again. Want to find our boss room. We got five keys, one bomb. I, You know what? I think we should try it. I think we should try it. What do we got? Something good? I mean, nice snack. Nice little HP up that does absolutely nothing since we're capped at three. Which makes um, the keeper very difficult. Again, very, very difficult to play is that you're, you're stuck at that three. Get that. Pop that. Probably should have saved that for the room. The keeper versus Bombino. There is a secret with Bombino. You let him tap you and you give him some money, he disappears. I'm not going to test it here on this daily. Maybe I'll try it on a regular run. We want to make sure we have enough HP to survive. Down goes Bombino. One, two, three. What do you got for me? Glass eye? I'll take it. Damage and luck. Did we go to our treasure? We didn't. How are we on timing? 10 minutes. I think we'll be able to make it to our boss rush, but now look at our damage 8.71 Pretty nice. I could win with nine um, Especially with this triple shot But I want to maintain my wooden nickel play So we'll see it's very questionable. It's really gonna come down to What we get in our angel deal Luigi board's good nice little tears up again, so we're not 2.50 Which is insane with this triple shot I mean, look at our look at our speed coming out of this. Nice, nice. So DPS, I want to say somewhat under control. Now we just need some insane synergies for survivability. It'd be nice to get an angel deal, but we didn't, so we should get it on this floor. But we want to play a little bit careful when we're playing as a keeper. Again, he he just positioning is a hundred percent map at its utmost importance. Like something like this, it's okay to stop moving. Just to re remove yourself from the area completely. But with this tier rate, it's phenomenal. We should be able to shred everybody. And go straight to it like that. Look at this. Especially with spectral tiers. It would be nice to get piercing shots with this build. We want to go fast. Now that we got a little bit of a uh, juice in the tank with our tier rate and damage, we want to move a little bit faster. We might have to sacrifice a floor. When I mean that, I mean get rid of one whole treasure room completely. Go straight to the boss and get out. Just to maintain our quick little boss rush item. That I, I had a feeling the super jump was coming eventually. Careful, push that back. There's a secret room with no bombs though. Get rid of them for that super jump. We want to avoid that super jump. Maintain our HP with that wooden nickel. Let's go to the left. No bombs, can't do anything about that. There's a shop. Why can't... Oh, duh, we gotta press the button. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Almost didn't make that. What do you got for me? Uh, yeah, honestly, 4.50 battery with the wooden nickel is incredible. We should be okay. See, what the 4.5 volt battery is going to do, it's going to... Actually, I should buy a bomb. It's going to um, increase our active item charge within the room. So we're fighting a boss, we're always going to get a charge, and that's something you want to do. That's like the ultimate survivability when you're playing as a keeper. So we shouldn't lose the run. Um, confidently, you can sit there and say that we should not lose this run. Since that is our ticket right there. Blow you up. What I, I would want some nice hit. That was a good hit. 
Uh, Wheel of Fortune, I don't care for it. We definitely need... Yep, I'll take this. We need more speed. 0 0.90 is not where you want to be at. All right, let's go all the way left. That's where our boss is. And mind you, we're seeing all the area we need to go to. And that's because of the cracked orb. I think it's called Sacred Orb or something like that. So we know exactly where we need to go to. Even though it's like the last room. I'm a little concerned about our HP. But again, with, with a nickel 4.5 volt battery, we should be okay. We need this before we die. We almost got rocked there. Look, see, we're able to pop it again. And then we're going to pick it up again. Because of the 4.5 volt battery, it helped out tremendously. Pick up a box of stuff. What is this? Ball of steel? Sure, why not? A magician should help out tremendously. And the wafer, I'm not sure exactly what it can do. But I want to increase my angel deer percentage. So we'll go straight for it. And we're going to constantly pop. Look at that. Pop, constantly pop our wooden nickel. Can I blow these up with the bomb? I could. All right, nice. Get some soul hearts out of that. That's sick. And let's go again. We gotta continuously move. And the only reason why I fought the angel statue was to get more percentage on an angel deal when you hold the key. So right now we're at twenty one point one percent. We have to play this. Uh, what does this do? But penny. Does that synergize with that? It kind of does. We could make that work. We could definitely make that work. Oh, they blow up. Careful, careful. Remember, we want to pop the wooden nickel as many times as possible. All right, with eight keys, we don't need the shop key thing anymore. We'll get rid of you first. We got that mom's contact, so it should freeze everybody. It's going to concuss everybody. Pop a wooden nickel again. Get rid of you. Get some bombs and go. We got to go. I think this is the floor we sacrifice. Careful. Yeah, I'm happy to sit there and say this is the floor we have to sacrifice. Wait, how many time? 14 minutes in? Yeah. We gotta go. Gotta find our boss and go. Um, I got the 4.5 volt battery. I don't really think I need anything to, uh, from the shop. I'm gonna check it out. Yeah. Oh, you know what? That was a waste of money. That was a waste of money. Think about it this way. Uh, we're not gonna get that much treasure rooms anymore. No seek room there. Okay, so we're at 22.7% deal with the angel. So we want to speed this up. Let's go down. We went the wrong way again. That's not what we want, though. We don't want to go the wrong way. Obviously, we ran into many dead ends. It's got to be down here. Now, we could purposely take hits. Pop the wooden nickel again. If we feel it need to. Grab that key. Should be one more. Where is he? Where is he? I have no idea where he is. There he is. Where'd he come from? I'm, I could tell you right now. I did not know he was over there. He definitely wasn't over there. Anybody jump in some havoc. Look at that. Again, we went the wrong way. So an idea, right? Of going to the boss rush might not happen. Careful. Okay, well, that was huge. We almost got rocked there. Unless we just like find a miracle route, right? Like on the next floor, we just go straight to it. Careful. We went to all the wrong way. That's insane. Let's go down. This is the boss. This is where the boss is. It's not where the boss is. Blow you up. Pop the wooden nickel as always. Pop the wooden nickel. Wow. Okay. So we have four minutes to get to our boss rush on the next one. So we got to clear this floor out and then make it straight to mom in hopes of finding the skull with the X on it. And then we'll be able to be cheesy with it. A room like this is horrible for us. Luckily, we got that worked out for us. Um, I'm going to go for IBS, your stomach rumbles. Not sure what it does, but I'm down. There's our boss. Careful. I'm about to say, does it matter when we take the hits? Is that it? And there's a super se a secret room and a super secret room. So we have a little time. Let's check it out. I don't care for that, to be quite honest with you. We might as well check out our secret room since we're we're literally right here. Hope for something good. Trash. I mean, I could feed you. I just, I'm really short on time. I think I just want to go straight to it. The Keeper versus Loki. Freeze him up. Oh, interesting. IBS, how, is that how it works? Every time I activate my active item? Cause that's sick if that's how it works. Interesting. Mom's lipstick range up. Yes, mother. And let's go. All right. So this is the floor. We got to go ham. We got to quickly find let's go with the x on it with three minutes left let's go 
If we could find it on our first go around, that's insane. Are we just dropping random bombs every time we pop uh, our active item? Because that's sick. Careful. Anybody that jumps and removes himself from the field of vision is a, is a havoc for us. Sequence probably here. Okay, it's not there, so it's obviously on the right. We're going the wrong way too much times. Careful. HP, gotta watch our HP, we're at two. Careful with that, no key drops. Not what I'm looking for. Perfect, that's what we want, some money. Thank you. Blow you up immediately, careful. It's funny that we're dropping like poops everywhere. I respect that. We want to stick mana. Damage HP up. I mean, we're sitting at 9.07. That's pretty good. Let's go with the XR. That's what it is. That's where it is. Not what we want. Almost got rocked there. I don't have no idea how that happened. All right, so let's go up. Careful. We're still okay on time. We got to find a way to beat mom quickly. Mom's foot. Yo, that IBS is not that great. There's our boss. Okay, okay. We're still okay. Careful. Go straight to it. I'm not even gonna look at the time. Keep a response foot. Go for it. Freezer, that's what we want. Pop that. I shouldn't have picked the money up. Fighting a boss, I gotta leave that money on the ground. So we can take two hits and then pick that up. Wait for it. Go for it, go for it, go for it. There we go. Got it. Not what I wanted. Pop that. 19 minutes. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab this. Let's grab that. Let's see what we get in this boss rush. I'm surprised we made it. These are all really bad. I won't lie to you. This is a horrible boss rush. I mean, we might as well go for BBF5, Big Beautiful Fly. Okay, so we see where our secret room is. Might as well check that out. I had a feeling it was there. Oh, nice. Oh, I was about to say, I thought my boy was going to rock you. I like our trinket. Our trinket synergizes with the build. It's interesting. Moves all our money all over the place. What do you got for me? Um, we, He's not going to give us anything. You could probably give us something. But I don't want to waste HP for it. Careful. That was close. That was close. So I think how IBS works. Oh, careful. I think it's like random. Like that. That's just way too random for us. Very surprised we didn't take a hit there. Is there a reason to clear the floor out? Probably not, but at the same time, I want to see what's in our shop. Maybe we can get like another battery going. Pop that. The BFF is something we have to be careful with. Absolutely need school bag. And then we're going to buy Terra Cloth. Temperance machine. Which temperance machine? Blow them both up. We don't need it. For more money. And economy looking pretty good, man. Looking a little strong. Thing at 22 cents, 7 bombs, 12 keys. I think we're good to go. It's clear it's this last room. Has absolutely nothing in it. I almost got hit there, by the way. And we could sacrifice a little bit of HP to go into the boss rush. But at the same time, I don't really think it's worth it. Pop that. So what BFF is going to do, it's going to pop itself against any enemy it gets in contact with and explode. Kind of like how our IBS is working out. So extremely dangerous for us, considering we are playing as a keeper and we can't retain HP. So we're going to have to really rely on the 4.5 volt battery and the wooden nickel. Careful. Just got to really watch our positioning. We have to pay attention. Blow all this up. Perfect. What do you got? Nope. Not worth it. And the woman beyond, I mean, it kind of works out that we are the keeper. We're not really going to get rid of that. We're not going to really need to explore as much since every time we take a hit is a full coin anyway. And it, you can sit there and say the same thing because if you think about it, we did pick up the wafer. Did absolutely nothing for us. Because no matter what we take a hit, it's going to be a whole heart or a coin. Throw the poop. Gotta pay attention to our face. Apparently, the moment we get like red in the face, we, oh, we're dropping a, a poop somewhere. Our forget me now pill is insane. Oh, well, our forget me now room. So, what we could do is clear the floor out. And come back and redo it. Which helps us out because we get more items out of it. We get more boss drop items. Get rid of you. That creep on the ground. That would have been insane. Thank you. Super secret room probably. 
It is. Okay. That worked out. What do you got? What do you got? Huge toothpick tier of the shot. Speed up. Death card. Stars card. The moon card. Set me to it. Whoa. Look at this. Look what we found. Super secret room. Ultra mega secret room. Whatever you want to call a secret room. We get the ultimate sacred heart. Homie shots. Damage up. GG. Ladies and gentlemen. GG. Look at this. What is this? Pheromones? Tears up. Another tears up. Look at that. Our tears at 3.28 with Sacred Heart. That's sick, bro. That's sick. I was a little worried for a bit, but kind of happy that worked out for us. It's okay to take damage. Got that. Work our way up. Watch the brimstone. Oh, big hit. All right, watch HP. You got to really be careful. There's our secret room. Might as well go in there since we made the effort. We got enough keys to play you. I just don't want to play you. It's a choice. And let's go all the way to the left. Wow, what a payout. Sacred Heart, man. That's insane. We don't see that often. Definitely don't see that. Okay, let's maximize our HP. Let's go straight to it. The Keeper reverse Mr. Fred. Should be an immediate GG. Careful. Pop that again. Make sure our HP is under control. Magic 8 ball. Shot speed up, and then we get the Ace of Clubs. Um, again, we should go into here. We have money. We could buy Goat Head. Is it really worth it at this point? I mean, probably not. I will buy Backstabber. I like Backstabber, and I'm actually not gonna take Goat Head. Oh no, we're gonna re we got two more floors. We should definitely take Goat Head. And let's go straight to our dice room, right? And then redo the whole entire floor. Completely manipulate the whole game right now okay our speed's low so we gotta be careful we're still at 0 0.90 speed 3.28 tier rate 24.38 damage i mean that's pretty good our speed's a concern but again so some people these are just a lot of numbers but i like numbers and right now we're looking pretty good tier rate is what matters especially with this triple shot so we're pretty much doing the same exact floor again we have to do this get all this money bet faith i don't know what that does Oh, wow. Big hit. Convert, everybody. Just because we had it. Pop that. Get a coin. Get some money. Let's go. Bet the faith. Uh, what kind of trinket is that? Honestly, I could have stuck with um, our trinket with the, the farting penny thing, but I was getting annoyed really quickly with how our coins just scattered all over the place. Ah, I was just done with it. Careful. Careful. Throw that. Another tier is that we're at 3.68. We're getting really lucky. And we're playing with the keeper with negative one luck. I mean, you don't really see that often. Let's blow this up. What do you got? Okay, more HP. Uh, don't care for that. Perfect. Just completely shredded him. Uh, secret room was probably on the right. Probably wrong. <laughs> it's okay. Let's work our way up. Careful. Yeah, big hit. But I got my coin back, so again, we work with money. None of them are tears up. I think I remember what it looks like. I think it's the black and white pill. There's a secret room. Careful, careful. IBS is dangerous. Uh, let's go to the left. Yeah, we gotta pay attention to our face. That's what's gonna matter right here. To let us know what we shoot out. This is a dead end. So we see where our super secret room is. So most likely our boss is in that direction. And at this point in the game, we, we might want to speed run it. Just to rush to run. Oh, it's not where the boss is. Excuse me, I'm wrong. Let's see what it has to offer us since we're here. I'll take the money. No need to play that out. Again, with the 4.5 volt battery, what a nickel combo. We don't really need to play any type of beggar, a charge beggar, whatever you want to call them. We don't need that. There's our boss. Okay, perfect. Pop that. Get some money. Let's go straight to it. The Keeper versus the Matrix. He's a tough fight. But with the wooden nickel, again, we're going to pop it as many times as we could. Get that HP on the ground. Perfect. Get that. Give me Mr. Dolly. Range and more tiers. We're at 4.64. I mean, look at that. Um, ah, man, do I really want to risk it? I mean, we're not taking damage. We could take the risk and take this. But at, it's, I think it's too late in the game. And um, wooden nickel combo with 4.54. 4.5 volt battery wooden nickel combo. We don't really need a satanic Bible. 
I think we're pretty much okay. We are going to get another opportunity for Devil Leo, so no need to worry. We're going to get one more opportunity here. And hopefully, it works out for us. So let's get as much money as possible. Careful. Of course, we go to a dead end, as always, in typical Isaac fashion. Uh, we know where we stand on HP. We're at three coins, so the Crystal the Unknown is not that big of a deal. Secret room is probably on the left here. Let's go. Let's go. See what we got. I'm okay with fighting you. Give us money. Pop that. Let's work our way down. Ooh, perfect. Absolutely nothing. Right, let's go to the right. I feel like the boss is down here somewhere. Oh, man. This Sacred Heart combo is insane. Pop that. While I'm playing, like while I'm playing as a keeper and shooting, I'm paying attention to my face. The moment it gets red, I just throw away my whatever poop's going to come out. 14 keys. Why not? Let's open this one first. Yep. I'll take it. Guppy's eye is huge. I like Guppy's eye. It's going to let me know exactly what's inside any chest. I'm not going to pick up anything else. It's kind of pointless. See, now I know what this is. Eternal Heart in here. Some money. And this is going to be Torn Photo, which is exactly what we want. More tears up. Staying at 5, which is the cap. Especially with the triple shot. With 24.38 damage, Sacred Heart. This is like a GG. So we're, we're, we're okay. Pop you. Open that up. Get rid of you. And let's just continue on the way up since we went the complete wrong way. It's got to be up north. And I confidently said that. I said that. I was like, yo, the boss is down here. It clearly wasn't. Get rid of you. Pop that. Let's continue up. Another dead end. We like that. We like that. Let's go left. I guess it was, I was completely wrong. Careful. Got to pay attention to our face. I almost messed that up. Could have been a bomb explosion. And we're sitting at 49 cents. We already know what's in our devil deal, so no need to worry. Is there an opportunity to get guppy in this run? That'd be insane, but I highly doubt it. I actually started to think about we kind of need money, right? Since we'll be able to play at the end when we get to... Oh, no, we're not fighting the lamb. Never mind. Disregard, disregard. The keeper versus it lives. This should be rather quickly. Down goes the keep. The it lives. We know what's in our devil deal again. It's something we don't need. I mean, I might as well spend the money, right? And let's work our way down. Do we have enough to fight Hush? We probably do. Probably have enough to beat Hush, to be quite honest with you. But I think this run lasted long enough. Get rid of you. And get rid of you. Get a little money action. Uh, what do you got here? We could see again, thanks to Guppy's Eye, and that's why I bought it. We could see what's in the chest before we do anything, so we don't waste our time. Careful. And let's go to the right. Pop that. Absolutely nothing, but we want money. 48 cents is good. How insane would it be if we ran into money equals power? I mean, that would be a run right there. Whoa, careful. That was bad. I was not paying attention to that. With a speed of 0.9. That would have been devastating. Ooh, nice dead end. Careful, one more, yep. Yeah. And my BBF fly took him out. Yeah, when you have really low speed, like 0 0.9, around like 0 0.6, 0 0.9, it's very, very dangerous for enemies that like that, that absorb you in, pull you in. Extremely cautious on your positioning. I think this is where we're in. Shoal? Yeah, this should be the last floor. We should be okay. Pay attention. Chill out here. Yep, just chill. Just chill for a second. No need to rush. That would have been bad. Um, might as well. Whoa. Yeah, let's just get out of here. I'm not even going to bother. Knowing me, I'll probably take bad damage. We don't need this. I will stick with the bait. Bet Fate. That's what it's called. Bet Fate. Got it. Let's go down here. Careful. My BFF fly almost went ham, by the way. That would have been bad. Give him the ball. There it is. There it is. Careful. Watch the explosions. And let's go straight to it. The keeper versus this guy. Let's get ready to drop our bomb. One, two, three. Boom. Should be rather quick. We want, we want some wooden nickels on the ground. Pick that up immediately. Careful. Careful. Watch the feet that's dropping. Backstab is huge. Down goes this guy. Down goes the daily. Was that? That could have been. I felt like we made that a lot easier than what it was. Because playing as a keeper is always, always very, very difficult. But I appreciate you watching. If you like what you see, check out the channel. Like, subscribe. Till next time.